So I have a bit of a confession to make. In 30 years of riding, almost 25 of those being in dressage, I have never learned how to properly tie a stock tie. You know, you get to the horse show, you're like, oh, just get on, just pin it, whatever. So today, um, we're gonna learn how to properly tie a stock tie so that the rest of you don't end up in the same boat I am in. So this lovely stock tie today, and you know, there's so many beautiful designs out there in terms of stock ties. So mine is pretty and pink, of course. Now, it Velcros around your neck. When you, when you look at which way they go on, it's the small um, white part that goes up. So make sure that you've got it right side up and not the big white part over here that goes down. So you're gonna do that. So that, that part goes up. Then you flip this over uh, and then put it on your neck. So, and there's a little thing that goes through in the back. We're not gonna worry about that today. Now, you need three safety pins to properly tie your stock tie. The first one being to create the poofiness. So depending how poofy you like your stock tie, if you want it flat and out of your way, or if you want to give it a little bit of lift there, you, you can make that determination. I don't think there's any rules or laws or whatever. It just depends on your personality, if you want it really poofy, if you want it flat. That is 100% up to you. And then you pin it, hopefully not to yourself, but you pin it to your shirt. Now, the next step is to pin one side. So again, you're looking at how you want this to look at the show. So you're gonna pin, again, this side. You put it in the right place that you want it to hang. I've got my little mirror here. Take another safety pin, and then you're gonna pin it once again down to your shirt so it stays in place while you're riding. Third step, you're gonna take the other side and do the same thing. So you're gonna pin it, put the plate, put everything in place again. This isn't ideal because I'm rushing it a little bit and my mirror's not great, but then you take the third safety pin and again, you're gonna pin it down to your shirt, okay? Now that you have that all in place and everything's all sorted, you're gonna take your stock pin and pin it onto your stock tie. Now, the, the most rugged and sturdiest place to pin it is right onto the white in where it, it crosses over. I mean, you can pin it wherever you like, but that's gonna be the sturdiest place to put your pin. And so we're gonna just pin that quickly. I'm not gonna do that up for the sake of the video, but you get the idea because it's crooked. But you get the idea. So, three safety pins, one stock pin, and you are all set to go. Now, officially know how to tie a stock tie, so there's no excuses for droopy stock ties.